right, this is Calabos, and we are playing Minecraft, and this is Skybees. So I just did this. Um, I just put down slave controllers and botany pots, and just to get my uh, my um, mystical flowers going. I don't really have all that many, but this should fix that. Uh, I've also thought about how I can get uh, automation for some more of this stuff. Um, so I've got mana going here, but it occurs to me that we need to make more of the, uh, uh, dream, uh, elven, elven. Uh, we just need to like get this going a little bit better. We're gonna uh, because this one wasn't keeping up. Now I don't think this one is keeping up. Uh, what are you aimed at? You are aimed at that. So that's done. We need to I think it's going up. It's hard to tell. It's actually a flower for that, because honestly there's a flower for basically a lot of stuff in in Tanya. Let's get rid of this. The other thing that I did off camera while I was waiting for stuff to do, whatever, is I finished the uh, decorative stuff on the on the um, mob spawner. Uh, so that's done. I actually captured one of these in the... in a... Uh, in a one of the, those things are called the uh, mob imprisonment tools. Okay, so, uh, there was a thing, it happened stuff. Uh, so this is going, we have stuff, we have uh, accelerated movement of mana around all of this nonsense. Um, you'll notice that I'm holding structures and star metals and stuff and things. So I was looking at this and I have begun setting this up. So the way we get star metal ore is we take iron Watch this magical trick. And we put it where one of these little funky beams are. Then that gives us star metal ore, right? I'm basically going to set up exactly what we have here, which is what I'm doing this. So let's find a dirt. To holes in the ground. I guess we could, but I don't see the value in it. That one's gone forever. Uh, I also put an elevator here because I'm tired of like hiking all the way over there and all the way back and stuff. And we swapped this out for mechanical pipe. 
this mechanical pipe. What this will do, uh, let's go and get a drawer. Let's rush over here because it's going to do its thing without us. Oh, drawer, star metal. That is not star metal. God. Let's do it this way. This way seems much less likely to raise my blood pressure. Or not. There we go. Let's toss this system. Let's get a key. Oh yeah, we were waiting on one of these. We were waiting on ink to make books, and now we have it. Question is, what happened to our drawer key? I'm sure that we had one. Point. I don't know. Whatever. Let's look at star metal. Uh, let's. Hop back over to Astral Sorcery. Uh, Destructor. Destructor only works without redstone signal. Uh, this emit signal went above the amount. Pretty sure that this is hooked up. Uh, this and not there. Take a look, I guess. Destructor should only work without redstone signal. I should pick up star metal ore. Definitely star metal ore. Destructor should. No, it should be working, I think. Oh, right, try this. Ha! <laughs> That's the problem. So now, um, I always mess up the whitelist, blacklist, because I apparently wrongly assume that whitelist is the default. But blacklist is apparently the default. So this should go until we have 2048 of the star metal ore. While the moon's coming up, let's do this thing. So I struggle with this intensely because I have trouble seeing the constellations. But we should we should do this. So fortunately there's only like five that we need to find. And you can find them in the book. Here, constellations. So, I found one. Uh, I don't know where it is. 
colors, but typically you can see it in the sky somewhere. Uh, it's gone. Whatever. Uh, thought I found one. Did I not find one? I was I was pretty solid that I had found this one. Uh, Decidia. Uh, so what we're looking for ow, are the blinky stars. Uh, and I I honestly have a lot of trouble picking them out. Show me this already. So blinky stars like this one. Uh, and what we're supposed to do is play connect the dots with the blinky stars. And I think this is a Vorsio. Right. Okay, so this one. Uh, I actually have the, the thing pulled up on the side. Uh, what about... Okay. Um, okay, so and it's sort of a race against time. You have to uh, find all of them before the sun gets bright enough that you can't find them anymore. Only see And I told you I am I am terrible at this. Uh Looks like a Vicio. So So one of the things that further complicates this is that certain constellations are only visible during certain phases of the moon. Uh, so I think that, let's see, we've got the Avitas left. So to narrow this down, using the telescope, we can only see um, uh, like the first couple of them. So Avitus, Amar Armara, Decidia, Avorcio, and Vicio. Look, see, there's another one right there that we. tell just looking at it that it's one there. So 
but the next step here is attunement. Um, that will show us a couple of more. But you can track which ones you have, because once you have them, they actually show up in the sky all the time like that. One, two, three, four. That might honestly be all of them. Yeah, I don't know. I think that might be all of them that we, we can do with this. Uh, so one of the next steps here is let's look at improving our altar. So this is the Starlight Crafting Altar. So with the Starlight Crafting Altar, we can actually improve this to the Celestial Altar. So let's take some Stardust, make Stardust. So Stardust is made Isn't there like a, you know, we've got this instructional manual here, and I, I hate the scrolling. That's the one thing that really frustrates me about this mod is all of the, the finger scrolling. Kind of Okay, here we are. So, uh, blah, 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 blah. Celestial altar. So we need a star metal cutting tool, which is gonna be used wood. Used wood is made from liquid starlight. So one of the things that we're gonna need a lot of is liquid star might not. Uh, liquid starlight. Don't necessarily have a lot of that, so export. So I think that we can just kind of do this. I'm not sure if it has to be up or not. Um, we go ahead and we make this. What should we call it? Aquamarine. Oh, we'll really have to do this connected there. That might not necessarily be an inventory slot. I know that there's a way to do it. Take an aquamer. Let's try dropping it on it. So it's specifically a right click. Uh, so if we take a dispenser, maybe.
Uh, so you'll see that it is, in fact, pumping liquid out. Should be pumping liquid out. Theoretically, it is pumping the liquid into here. Going on star metal. So we have 308. The uses for star metal, let's grab one really quick. Star metal, so we can smelt it. Then the uses for the star metal ingot. This gives us a diamond, which could give us a recipe for elytra. Huh. So, if we can get our hands on one elytra uh, and some dragon scales, and that will set that up. Let's pop over here. Want exporter with a regulator, and that assumes, of course, that this works. Let's get another light well going. We'll practice with it. Light well, otherwise we're gonna have to wait forever. So a light well is going to require uh, any rock crystal, which I'm sure we have. Chiseled marble. So I think that, yeah, we, we have bees that make us rock crystals, that's fine. Well, now all we need is a little bit of starlight and nighttime. There's a way to make it nighttime in this pack. Uh, you know, I don't know. I'll I'll have to to look into that on that. Or like a grinder. Um. Thought like a rind something. So we'll need to also set up nocturnal powder.
Okay, so this triggered. So let's get a silver bricks. There. Wants to bucks. Okay. Be a way to audit it. felt certain that I have automated this before. Let's let's check the the book. I mean that doesn't make any right. Light well. Quick. Block directly above the opening of a light well must remain empty. Powered by external starlight. From face. More than their base forms. I guess for the moment it doesn't really matter. We're not using a lot. There's got to be. Maybe I'm not facing it the right way. Like I thought that we could do it. Okay, that's empty. Light well. Power.
Fuck. You know, I don't know. Like, it should be right-clicking it, right? For the moment, it's not a big deal. We'll figure it out. Uh, let's go ahead and make a second light well, though. Uh, start light. Full resonating wand. So many wands in this mod. So the other thing that we want to do is we want to upgrade this altar. So upgrade this one, we're going to want, uh, oh, we still need the Stardust. Uh, grinding tool. So let's grab a little bit of This grab a bucket. Grab some wood. So what we'll probably do is automate this as well. I think that's how you do it. It's not. I mentioned I'm not super fond of this mod. Oh, that, that went all weird. time travels so quickly here. I just hate phantoms. Don't see the point in them. I don't feel like we've done a whole lot, but it is time to call the episode. Got a little, a little bit of, of stuff done there, and... Right, burn. Um, uh, well, I, I did its thing. So we've got a little bit of stuff there. We've automated this. Uh, we'll figure out how to automate this in the future. Um, I'm not sure how we can do that, but we're going to do that. So I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, leave me a like. If you didn't, don't. Just questions, comments, concerns, they all go below. Have a good night.